Amara Jones. Amara Jones. Amara Jones. Also with us is Amara Jones. One out of three people in this country uh, are poor and either close to poverty, work, and don't make enough to live. It One out of three. It's a shame, of, it's a shame of this nation that that's the case. The United States doesn't have a problem with spending. We have a problem with revenue. Spending doesn't create deficits. Not paying for stuff does. Hey, you're watching HuffPost Live. I'm Mark Lamont Hill. Hurricane Sandy is making front page headlines. What the United States needs to do is figure out not how to cut, but how to spend. We need climate justice and we need it now. That's what Amara Jones says. The relationship between uh, race and, and, and climate change, and that's something that most people think is color neutral or colorblind. Well, Sandy is colorblind. The problem is that our society isn't. And the way that we've constructed it actually hardens and calcifies um, a lot of inequities and inequalities that already exist. Lack of investment in the things that create broad-based economic growth are showing up in incomes. They're showing up in terms of living standards. And they're showing up in terms of where our economy is. Three-fourths of the people that were made homeless by the storm live in public housing. The economic impact of recovering from the storm is hardest in those areas. Unless there's a, a dramatic change in the Republican Party, demographics aren't on, on their side. And so this is an attempt to remake the electorate, taking out certain jelly beans to make the whole jar look a certain <laughs> color. Companies will go where costs are lowest, and costs are lowest, where oversight is less and where there's less regulation. And that's one of the problems that we have now, that corporations and these subcontractors and companies are always one step ahead of the regulatory regime that we normally think of place that protects workers um, and saves lives, and that's just not the case here. Let's don't destroy the military and just cut blindly across the board. That's Republican Senator Lindsey Graham on Fox, your response. Well, the premise is wrong, and this is one of the key problems with the approach in Washington. This is the problem with the way that we constructed the global economy. Everyone pays. At some point, someone pays. It may look cheap to you, and it may be cheap to you, but someone is either paying with their life or with their quality of life mm -hmm. on the other end, and so we need to reevaluate as consumers our expectations around cheap and what that means.